update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we begin our day with a mixed bag. The mix coming from the NASDAQ 100, down 59 points. The other U.S. indices are trading to the upside. Dow's up nearly 200 points, S&P 4. Now, Russell's up 35, Semi's up 21, Tranny's 270. Uh, the New York Stock Exchange up 119 points. We've got gold trading up nine bucks. It's off of its highs. Silver's up 22 pennies. Trading out of 31.98. Natural gas off seven cents. Uh, Lights be crude is back up 42 pennies. And a 30 year treasury up a half a point. Trading out 121.17. Let's figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We'll begin with the ES Mini. ES Mini is forming a new profile. We've got resistance up at the 5879 level, support at 5802. Just consolidating with inside that. If we get a close back about 5879, the A to B equals CD pattern will be back on its way up to the 6012 level. If we take a look at the spot VIX index, it is trading just, uh, well, it's trading a bit lower than yesterday's close, but still well above the 50-day exponential moving average, the 50-day at 1834, the spot fix at 2035. That says that sellers are still the ones that have an edge. If we take a look at the NQ, which is our weekend to see out here, it has confirmed a new profile, support at 2135, resists up at 2524. If we take a look at what's going on inside of the U.S. dollar index, we did have a failure of the euro in its TD9 count bottom pattern yesterday. We discussed that. That increased the odds that the dollar wants to make a move up towards its TD9 count top at the 104.16 level. We have uh, gold, which uh, tested its uh, TD9 count top, tested and rejected that, tested and rejected the top of its profile, and that's up at the level of 26.90. I suspect that price will still get above that level and go ahead and take out the all-time highs. Silver has a consolidation with inside its profile, support at 30. 363 resists up at 3272. Light Street Crude likely targeting the bottom of its profile, and that support levels at 6876. If we take a look at natural gas, it's trading below its swing point. This was a swing point low uh, from back in uh, September, September 3rd, and it closed below 2.439. Now, I believe we've got a TD9 count pattern. So let's make sure we take a look at uh, natural gas. I believe we're forming bar number nine today. In the case of the 30-year Treasury, more likely than not, it wants to go target the top of its profile. That's at the 122.16 level. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show, if you will. But if you have to off to start your Wednesday, please have a wonderful one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.